Hi, today I'm going to be showing you how to train your guinea pig to jump. First, you need a boundary, so an open end for your guinea pig to like go into its house, and you need a boundary so it doesn't run off the sides. Now, what you need, you need a clicker. You need some poles, so I have um, a drum sticks, a, one of those long pencils, and I have a plastic thing, it still works, okay. You need something for your guinea pig to run under, or, yeah, and most importantly, a guinea pig. So first of all, what you do, get your house and you just put it at the end there yep and then you get one of the poles and just slide it under so it's not really a jump it's just something to run it and then make sure you have this in your hand and you get your guinea pig and you wait for it to jump over and when it jumps over and you leave her in there you let her do that a few times so take her out again and wait for her to go again she'll get better, better at it very time she'll get better every time okay and then Get another one, get another pole, and just slide it on top of the other one. So it's a bit higher for her. Stay there, pudding. Go, go. Give him a little bit of a nudge. Good girl. Get putting it, get the guinea pig again. Wait for it to go across. Good girl. I'm not doing Okay, then get a, another one and slide it on top of the other one. Now, pudding is new to this, so she won't be very good. So you just keep on repeating the process. She's very good at it today. Come on. No, 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 no. They might try to do that. So just pull them back again and let them start again. So you just keep on doing that, and then once they get good at this height, go back down and do a small cross. So like that, and then get bigger and bigger every time. So like that. And then do this. Get one just on the floor. I can get it in there. Get 
one on the floor and then get one above it on the next square and then, and then make him jump over that and then get another one put it over up like that and if they try to squeeze through the gap get a different another block and put it underneath that's why I have this curly one because she gets scared of it so she doesn't go near it so yeah just keep on doing that eventually you'll have a you know, you'll have a pretty good thing oh and if you want to know where I got my clicker from it was $10 per bun. Bye.